Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I love pro player bugs, especially ones that don't like destroy the economy of the game, but they still help, especially growing players, okay? What we're about to do is discuss something that's really cool that a few of you have reached out to me for that honestly, I think Kabam just needs to keep because we are in the process of discussing and I know so many of you, it's like your ears bleed when we say it. But it's either going to be Relics or 7 stars. I don't know what's going to come first. It seems like Relics are going to come first. But they're a way to try to progress champions and grow rosters and get the whales to keep spending, especially those of you who have like 100 rank 3s and 12 rank 4s, whatever the crazy top number is right now. Uh, trying to get those people to continue to spend while not breaking the game. So if 7 stars or Relics, you know, basically close to rank five, six stars, the equivalent of, if those things are beginning to be discussed, then like an early access bundle deal now that guarantees you the featured five star is like cool, but a featured five star at this point, if there's two more stars above it in terms of like appeal to the average community person, I feel like it's like getting a four star now. Not that that means that the five star is gonna hit like a four star because if it's a really good five star, like say Hercules, it's obviously going to hit like a six star or seven star. But of course you can have a six star or seven star that hits like a three star. Uh, with that being said, I have somebody that approached me today via Twitter. He signed up for Twitter just to message me. How flattering is that? Now, he could have read the description box of every video I post now and sent me an email. <laughs> But he chose to go to Twitter. Now, this is concerning the Valkyrie store. Specifically, this is concerning when you scroll all the way down. And you see the three-star shards, right? Three-star shards for 700 Valkyrie currency. Okay, so we're going to blacken the screen right now. And next time we turn on the screen, we are going to see... A Twitter video let's pull that up now huh so the video starts to be a little blurry and then it gets better remember that Twitter is the second to worst way to contact me because it compresses footage so much I guess it's, it's in the top three worst ways to contact me if you if you uh, attach anything via an email without putting it through Evazone or Dropbox or Google Drive then the quality is gonna be so blurry it's gonna be like this it's hard to see and then, of course, if you send me any message via Instagram, I can't even turn things horizontal on Instagram. So it's it's just the worst. All right, so check this out. He recorded this video where he has less than 2,000 four-star shards. And then he goes to the Valkyrie store, and he scrolls all the way down, and he goes to buy three-star shards. See how it just got crisped itself for whatever reason? All right, so he goes to buy 8,000 three-star shards. And when he goes back to his four-star shards, what do you know? By buying three-star shards, he has actually given himself 8,000 four-star shards. That's really cool. Giving, especially growing accounts, not for grind one walled, but other accounts, uh, giving them a free four four-star crystals is not going to break the game. It's not going to wreck the economy of the game. It's just going to allow, especially growing accounts that may actually need four stars, especially you like contenders out there, proven players. It's going to give you a chance to to maybe clear content faster. And it's not like they can take these four stars into anything past Act 5. So again, it's not like it's going to break the game. It's just going to be a really cool thing to include in the future of these accounts. So... I love that right now it's a bug. If you want to immediately buy all the three stars and, and try yourself, uh, go for it. I'm going to save all of my currency to first get tier three alpha and tier six basic. But hey, if you need more ISO, you might as well do it now too. You know what? Screw it. We're going to test it out on my account. And we're going to see, because if they've already patched it, then the takeaway is going to be they shouldn't have patched it. Okay, so uh, we are going to make sure that we do the math right on this. So my four star... Shard account count is 11,603. So if it works, it's going to be at 19,000. So we're going to go to the Valkyrie store and we are going to go to three star 
shards and we're going to purchase all 8,000. We will go back and we will see 19,000. There you go. Buy ASAP. Kabam, keep it in there. It's a really cool thing that's not going to break the game, but it's going to help, especially those beginning players. And also, again, four-star crystals give you more ISO than three stars, which is going to help with gold and just raking up champs in general, especially after so many new champs came to people's rosters for July 4th weekend.